Hey guys, so today I'll be turning into Mystique. So first I'm going to create the scales on her forehead and the sides of her face. And for that I'm going to be using the flush latex that I got from Party City. So now I'll be using this small brush and I'm going to dip that on the liquid latex and start creating the scales. Now if the scales aren't the way you want it, just take a tip at the end of the brush like this one and or any other tools and just sharpen up the shape. Now I'm going to take it again and draw another teardrop on the side and another one on the side so just you guys can look at the picture and just follow the pattern if you wish or you could just create little teardrops and just different shapes. So now I've basically created um, teardrop shapes, longer teardrops, and circles, kind of giraffe spots, and everything in my forehead. Now I'm going to let this dry and I'm going to move on to the sides of my cheeks. Alright guys, so I'm basically done drawing the scales on my face, so you guys can follow this pattern or, or just create your own. Okay guys, so the scales are dry, and now I'm going to paint myself using this blue um, cream makeup. So here's my stippling brush, and I dipped that on the blue paint, and now I'm just going to stab it on top of my forehead this down on the cheeks the last time I remember being this blue was when I did my avatar makeup so the paint is applied and now I'm going to move on to the eye makeup. For the eye makeup, I chose this blue eyeshadow from NARS and it's called the Night Flight. And it's a perfect misty color. So I'm going to take that eyeshadow and apply that right on top of my top lid and just blend that in. Now I'm just going to take my flat brush and pick up some of that black eyeshadow and just put it on under the eyebrows. Now I'm going to take the same black eyeshadow and apply that underneath my lower lash line. To shade the scales, I'm going to take this cream blue eyeshadow and apply that on top of the scales. So this is all for the makeup and now we're going to move on to the hair and just spray paint it all red. So for the hair, I just used a temporary red hairspray and uh, I was actually doing it on video but it got a little messy so I had to go to the restroom. So um, here it is and this is the complete look. If you guys want to add the yellow contacts then go ahead. I'm trying to avoid contacts for now because my eyes have been a little irritated lately. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and I'll catch you guys soon. Bye!